Finally tonight, there's no place like home, especially for NASA astronaut Frank Rubio after a six-month mission turned into a record 371-day space odyssey. Here's Tom Costello. Less than 1,000 meters from touchdown. Frank Rubio wasn't supposed to set a new American space record. He would have rather been home, celebrating some big milestones in his four kids' lives. But today, finally. Touchdown confirmed at 6.17 a.m. Central Time. Rubio's record ride comes to an end. He was safely back on planet Earth in Kazakhstan. That's good to be home. Rubio got stuck on the space station after his ride home, a Russian spaceship, was hit by space junk and sprang a coolant leak. A six-month mission turned into 12 months while he waited for a replacement ship. The greatest challenge, he says, was psychological. I think the most difficult one, again, is pretty easy, just the separation from family. Uh, that's been a challenge. A year in space also carries unique health risks, increased radiation exposure, body fluids that shift to the head and cause vision changes, muscle and bone loss in microgravity can lead to balance troubles back on Earth. There's a lot of science that has to happen in the first few weeks, and then there's getting back to enjoying life. Rubio is also a combat veteran and doctor who was vigilant about staying in shape in space. I feel like I've uh, stayed at a pretty high level up here, uh, so it'll be interesting to see what those first couple of days feel like when I'm back on Earth. Now, after orbiting the Earth nearly 6,000 times, Frank Rubio is one step closer to home. Tom Costello, NBC News. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.